night and day You are the one Only Hi, this is Chef Janie and today we're going to be making a Mexican dip. This is one of my children's favorites and I think you're going to enjoy it too. The first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to use one and a half uh, containers of cream cheese. Blend that up a little bit with a hand uh, mixer and then you'll want to add about oh about a 16 ounce to a 24 ounce container of small curd cottage cheese and you're just going to want to put this on some sort of a platter and since we're going on an outdoor bonfire I just put it here inside of a Tupperware container now on top of this we're going to sprinkle a little bit of taco seasoning mix put it on gently here Now I've just rinsed a can of black beans and rinsed them and cooled them off with some cold water and we're just going to drizzle these right on top just like this. We're having a rather sunny day today here in the kitchen so <laughs> put this there you go where you can see it a little better. Okay just put on however many that you like. My kids love them so I'll put on some extras here and just want to kind of press them in just very lightly tap them in just a little Next, bit. We're just going to top this with some shredded cheddar cheese. I'm using mild cheddar. You can use Colby Jack or whatever you like. Okay. We'll spread that and kind of just lightly pat it just a little bit here. Now next we've just finally shredded some lettuce. I used my chef's knife for this and we're just going to sprinkle some of this on top. Now once we've dolloped this with the sour cream, I'm just going to add a couple of chopped tomatoes. And I'm just using canned that I've squeezed the juice out of. There we go. And since I didn't have black olives, because normally I'd put black olives on this, and you can actually put the tomatoes on right after you do the cream cheese, uh, cottage cheese mixture. But the kids just kind of add some color. So I like to put a little bit of the tomatoes right here on top. And since I didn't have any black olives, I'm just going to go ahead and add just a few uh, more black beans right here, just for some color. And here you have it, my Mexican dip. Now these are great with tortilla chips. Now you'll just want to cover this with a lid and refrigerate this for about three hours. This is uh, the gluten-free chef, J.D. Pendleton with my gluten-free tortilla dip. Enjoy.